which is pretty much vlogging. This is vlog number four today, and I really don't like to really do my vlogs back to back, but apparently I feel like I now have to. Um, today's vlogging rant, or it could be a rant, could be just my opinion on stuff, or it could be just anything. It's pretty much Facebook. Facebook, as many, many of you guys who is like me, I have a fan page for my mark business. Which has been doing exceptionally, the fan page growing thing has been doing pretty good. I'm almost at 1300 fans. Which, by the way, was not easy doing. Which I did pretty good since, um, March. I mean, not March, February. January, no, I'm sorry, January. I did pretty good at, of getting fan, fans and stuff like that. So I, I've been following along what we were supposed to do. I'm sorry, guys. The view is a little bit horrible because I'm sitting on I don't feel like let's move over so we can get some better light here. So yeah, um basically sorry. Basically Facebook today well it started last night. So I mean as I said I had a little giveaway going on on Facebook right there for the most referrals which was getting um the iconic um keep it going eyeshadow eyeliner doodle which is really great because I I came up with a cool look to go with. Today, I decided to put a little bit of makeup. Um, so yeah, I did that, and then, um, something else I did. I did that, and I was like, okay, okay, that's cool, because, um, you know, this gets, helps me get more fans, and I'm trying to get to 1500 because I wanted to do, like, a coupon giveaway thing. So, Facebook, so, some, apparently I'm hearing, um, Fan pages are being comment blocked for tagging, um, tagging, um, doing silent tagging. And silent tagging is what we do is for silent tagging. They have this thing that says this is a silent tag. What you do is to make sure you put your, you put your your um, link to your fan page on there, which is pretty much using that little at symbol, and then you put your fan page thing on there, and then you, you people go into around tagging and liking your pages without letting them know that, okay, this ain't, this ain't from whatever page it is, or if they decide to, to put it on there. So I'm like, okay, it's a cool way to get fans. It's been me. But apparently, I guess, it's been a little bit more out there now, and I guess a lot of people do more silent tagging than regular, like, okay, scrolling thing, so Facebook decided to put a crackdown on it. So, if you get comment blocked, you pretty much, you pretty much comment blocked for 15 days, and then after 15 days, then you'll be able to access, being able to, like, go ahead and just do other, like, tagging and liking pages and stuff like that. So, pretty much, you're at a standstill for 15 days, because you have silent tag and you get caught. Other pages are not only there, they're being in the banning. And then apparently that they decided to, you can't do raffles, you can't do auctions, you can't do tagging events, you can't do anything without doing it. So I'm like, really, really not really happy right now. So now I just go ahead and just revert all my giveaways, either fan pages or from my fan page or anything. I'm just going to revert them to here on the YouTube. Like I said, um, check the last couple of videos. There's a mini giveaway going on. And in Saturday, don't you want to win free item, a mark item? And if it goes good, I'm going to, if I get some more responses, I'm going to add another item in there. But I'm just thinking like this. I mean, what do you guys think about it? I mean, for those who have fan pages and, the, um, promoting your giveaways and stuff like that, what do you think about it? Do you think it's, like, wrong, especially for, like, um, direct selling companies like us to, that worked really hard to try to build up a fan base, to build up people, especially for me, because my business is affiliated with Avon, but we're not, the, they're not really, they're, Avon created it, but we just try to affiliate of being our own thing, and then, like, you know, we work so hard, Mark is getting recognized a little more and more, you know, celebrities are using it, celebrity promoting, Ashley Green is our new Mark ambassador, so she's been pretty good at promoting, and we work so hard to get recognized, you know, not recognized as an Avon company, but recognized as Mark, I mean, by itself, recognized as that, and then you want to go and check, kill our joy, our opportunity that we try to give to a way of giving people not only, you know, you know, we try to do giveaways to 
keep our fans to know that we love them and we appreciate the fact that you big guys being long and standing loyal fans. And then you go and you, you pretty much tell, basically, the only thing we can pretty much do is, seem like the only thing we can do is to say that if you want to place an order for this or you want to do a deal for this, check out our link here below for on our, um, on our other thing. So, I mean, which is fine, okay, because it takes a little bit to promote to our other page, our, our website, which is fine. But we can't do giveaways and promotional thingies. I don't get it. I don't. I don't really understand why the, the guidelines changed. Guidelines keep changing. Everything was fine before. And then they changed the guidelines to you have to make sure it's not telling people that your contest is or anything. It's not affiliated with Facebook, which is fine. And then they then they were like, well, you technically can't do it, but if you're gonna do it, to make sure you let people know that it's not affiliated with Facebook, which is fine and stuff. And then they for it, but seriously, now you, now you wanna okay comment by people for 15 days and say that you can't go and like their stuff because you started tagging, and then now you can't really pretty much do anything. I don't know what's going on. Now I bet you that they're gonna change the guidelines and then they're gonna update it and then. It's just going to be another big hassle, confusing, and try people trying to break the code of Facebook to do it. I was, it's just like, I don't know. I really, really, really don't know because it's just like I'm, I'm working really hard to promote things because, you know, not, I think of Mark as a fun, my fun at home based job. You know, it's, um, it gets me to be able to do things, you know, because without that, without the, the sales that I have gotten in, in, you know, the working at the temp job and stuff, I, you know, still, you know, it is just really down to my gears how, you know, I know I said it, I mean that, you know, we work so hard to build a fan page to promote, to let people know all the awesome deals that you come up with, that you came up with, which I would, by the way, was sitting down here writing really fun ideas and stuff on there, I had referral contest going on, I think, but, and I was going to end it, today was the day I was going to set the ending date for it, and then come to find out that all of this happened, so now I had to end it abruptly, though I didn't, it didn't even give an opportunity for other people to participate, now I feel like I'm being unfair, and I'm just doing because she had like 30 something people, 33 people that she referred, so, though probably some of them took on, but still, it's just a just the point of the matter is that, and then half them probably gonna be gone because they figure like, hey, I just helped Turkey her referral, I'm I'm gonna go. So it's like, oh, I don't know. I just like I really wish the Facebook would just stick to get rules and then stick to it and then leave it like that instead of just after all that hard work we we could do to establish ourselves as a direct selling company. For all of us who work hard to get fans and you know, write deals and do comments, we can't even do a, a, a comment auction where we have other vendors come in and do that. So that's gone. I had to close my auction, though, I mean, close my 100 fans, uh, no, I'm sorry, my 1,000 fan auction because that's what I wanted to do. I didn't want to do too much of a giveaway because, like I said, I'm trying to build a customer base and not just having people there for freebies. So now I was like, all my giveaways will have to be switched on here to my YouTube channel because apparently I can't really, until I can be able to figure out what exactly what Facebook is going to be doing and what actually the status of what they're going to do, I have to change it all to here. And I just think that's totally unfair because I mean, we did all that trying to get the people to come to the page, they go on there, like, oh I like your stuff, you know, and everything else, trying to get people to host parties and all that stuff, and then comes to find out. Oh, and Facebook wants to change it, and then all because of silent tagging, and then everything was it was going fine because I was gonna be like my um my auction was gonna close on the 22nd, and then my giveaway my um iconic referral contest was gonna give go on do a few days later after that, and then it's like now I just I have to cut them all off the cut my auction off last night because I was like me and then I was like due to Facebook regulations I have to close this so if anybody interested in any of the items that was there to go contact the sponsor. Right now I didn't have anybody contacting me yet. I don't know if they saw it or not and right now I just, I'm not going to really worry too much about it. I got enough stressful as it is to last me like 20 years. And then on top of that I had to go 
and get allergy medicine because apparently my allergies decided to just like, you know what, we're not going to go away. So I had to go and buy the generic brand, which, um, Walgreens had the chip that these were five dollars. So people the, 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 the some of them they had cheaper but they were like twenty four tablets, some twenty tablets. But this has thirty six. It has an extra set of tablets. So I was like, Well, instead of me going and trying to be retarded and go get the, the less tablets plus my allergies are always like flaring up and stuff like that. So why don't I just go ahead and get thirty six gel caps each I realize I hate gel caps. But they're fast release quick things, so it's like the only thing is it's probably gonna make me go to sleep. I think it's gonna make me go to sleep. But anyway, it's just like um this is gonna help for to prevent my uh, allergy from getting worse because I woke I woke up last night in the middle of last night, my eyes were just watery and falling. And I'm just like, Okay, this is still not the way to start today and then this morning my my left eye is a little bit swell, so I feel like I like look I look like I just woke up, even though I've been up since seven. But yeah, this is a very very fun day. So you guys comment or video response and let me know what you guys think about the Facebook guidelines for those guidelines for part for the like, fan pages or pages directly. If you have a fan page, let me know how do you feel about it because for me personally, I just think that for all everybody who worked so hard to get together up fans to to do what they need to do to, to build their fan base and it just goes down their heel because of the thing and uh, yeah I know I'm a little angry and I know I probably shouldn't be angry too much about it but hey it is what it is I know I know I know I know I know what you guys are thinking yeah but still I mean we work so hard for it why can't we uh why can't we just go ahead and do it I mean I'm so I'm I'm all stuttering here it's really making me annoyed because when I'm mad, I get stuttered. But it's just, I work so hard to do it, and I'm finally able to be able to squeeze some of the giveaways, which are a little bit of extras that I had of Mark here, and then it goes downhill. <sighs> but it feels good to, to vent to you guys because you guys are awesome and you rock. So, let me know what you guys think. If you post a comment or, you know, video response, then be great. Um, I got another video I'm going to be doing later. Um, it's not going to be a vlog. I hope, I, I it's one video that's going to work. I'm hoping it's not going to be a vlog. It's not going to be a vlog. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to do a vlog like that, but sometimes it helps. But I also want to say thank you guys for watching my last video about bullying because I noticed that it's right now, it's over 400 and something views, which is like beating the record of the most views of video. It's my most viewed video so far. I've been keeping up with my videos of people who watch the videos and stuff like that. So it's my most viewed video. And i like to thank you guys for actually watching it. Thank you guys for those who comment and their opinions on that. And I, I appreciate it. And like I said, I do read every comment that I get. And I do um, try my best to comment after you guys as a thank you and stuff like that. So don't forget... So also check out the video that's labeled mini giveaway and don't forget to enter because there's going to be a little, there's a little gift here, this little friend needs a home, so anybody gets, it's a really cute color and it's, it was part of my ultimate summer deal uh, thing, if not, um, if I can't, well this will be the substitute if I can't find the lemon sugar one, because the lemon sugar one was supposed to be the one thing, but I think I might keep the lemon sugar one and just sell this one, give, you, give this one away. But it's a really great color and everything like that. So I love giving away the juice gems because the juice gems, like I said, it's one of my favorite products. But it's not, it's part of my must-have category. So I might try to do a top 10 of my must-have that I keep with me at all times video. So stay tuned on it. And like I said, if you guys can comment what you guys feeling about this, let me know. You guys rock. I love you all. Bye.